Hey guys! Hey, it's Ryan. It's Ryan. It's her birthday. Yeah. Hey, we're over here at Hills Creek State Park outside of Mansfield, Pennsylvania, as the Dart of Destiny did point to decide. Us, decide for yeah. us. So we're here and we're gonna take a lakehead trail. Uh, I think we're gonna we did a northern one before a couple of months ago. We're gonna take the southern trail right now and just check it out and We'll see what we can find. Cheers. Be back. Bye bye. Well, we decided to take the North Trail. North Side Lakeside. Out of uh, Queen Anne's Lace and Jewelweed. All right. Don't have a tripod. We completely forgot the tripod. That would have been very, very helpful. But we're going to. Hike the trail a little bit. Gonna take a slow walk. Very slow. Very slow. And look for some mushrooms. So, if we find anything right now, we'll get back to you. Till then, cheers. Nice pine forest section. Yellow blaze marker. It's not too bad of a trail, so you won't get lost. There's just some service entrances. Last time we were through here, we found a lot of lactarius mushrooms and a few amanitas. But it's soon to get, it'll get grown up in time. Mm -hmm. Much cooler in here already. It's 83, 84 right now. And in here, it already feels like it's in the 70s. The nice, you can, I don't know if you can kind of see, you can kind of see the lake through the trees. Maybe I'll break in there a little bit so you can see the lake. Let's see it through there. All right. We're a little bit north of uh, 6 and a little west of 15, so I think that's why you can kind of hear some of those loud vehicles now and again. So, it'd be nicer if that was not a thing. I don't think we'll be hearing many vehicles when we go camping tomorrow. That should be I hope pretty, not. pretty interesting. Well, come up. We have a, a nice restaurant to eat at tonight. We have a historic hotel to be getting some footage of too. So, and we'll do a little uh, uh, Wellsboro walk after this. We just went to the York Colo Brewing Company, had a beer there. So, York Holo. York Holo. Well, it's York Holo. <laughs> it only looks like York Holo. It is York Holo, <laughs> but it's supposed to be York Holo because uh, it was named after Ralph York, who. Had, was a dairyman and dairy tags could only have eight letters on them so it was york h-o-l-o -O, york hollow which is not york olo but there you go found some shroomies all right we've got some shroomies there they are nice ones we found a chanterelle before we started which is a smooth chanterelle the road. Alongside the road, yeah, a little older. So, if we do find enough mushrooms to have a little lunch, we'll definitely film that. Huh? Until then, cheers. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs>
things. I don't know if they're fairy ring ones. They. Some old Actarius. Old Actarius down there. There is a Belit. Oh, I see it. Yep. Yep. I don't know if I can zoom out. I can't zoom because I'm filming. Apparently, that is not allowed. But there is a chest. Yeah. Yeah. Can't zoom in or out in this mode. But there is a. Let me get out. All right. There we go. Now we can zoom. There is a chestnut Belit. Right there. Take my hand. Grab me over here. Not zooming is it? Oh, son of a bitch. Okay. Oh. It looked like they're nice. Asian beauty, but if you really look into it, they're all those white mushrooms on that log. How pretty. Hello, sir. The old gnarly tree. North Woods. South Woods. And Ryan. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> we'll check him out. one just so we can see it okay look at that guy oh, he's not up yet he's not up yet you got gills What's i think he's a belete pores no it's smooth unless there's a webbing underneath let's check it out oh, it's too... no it's Smooth. It's a, it's some kind of belete coming up, or one of those Solaris mushrooms. It's got a sliminess to it, but there's no gills on it. There's another one right back there. Let him do his thing. Cool. Little curly dock here. Guess you can use the roots for this, and it's a good cleanser. Kind of interesting to see it on the trail here. I don't really see it on many trails. It's more of a field thing. But Queen Anne's Lace you can eat. Curly Dock you can use as digestive issues. <sighs> interesting. We are now taking the south road. The south trip. There's Ryan way down there. We're going to do that and take the south way across the lake. So, be back. Cheers. That hidey hole. It's awesome. Bird up there somewhere squawking. Nice day. That green stem right there in the middle, that's curly dock when it's still green. And again, you can use that as for the roots and leaves for to help with you know indigestion or what's the word digestion issues so we have a common one right here too let's look down here and see if we can find there he is this is heal all has a lot of good properties you can make teas out of this drink it daily it has a lot of vitamins and minerals and things that as the name says it just has so many good properties that very good to have the flowers and leaves as teas We're up on the south side 
of the lake trail and it's awesome. Big, nice trees. Very cool. Very cool breeze. <laughs> yep. You can see the lake easier. Real nice place. Easy walk too. There's a little bit more hills on this side, but the but the ground's nice. But we'll be we're be looking for mushrooms. Last year we found shrimp here, uh, lobster here. I think basically right here. Down so, towards the water. Down to the towards the water. We walked down there. We found it in here. So we're gonna hopefully can find some goodies again this year. Another interesting plant right here. You can see how the uh, the stalk, the leaves are actually the stalk's going directly through the leaves right in the center. This is bone set. Bone set you can make a tea out of, and it will definitely uh, break fevers, and so it'll really superheat your body. You have to take it a little bit at a time. It might make you nauseous, but it'll super heat your body and it'll help break a fever when you're when you're really sick.